guys, Metal Viking 82 here, back with uh, another small vinyl update. Uh, recently, I got my tax check. Yay. So, uh, decided to do a little vinyl shopping. I didn't find a whole lot that I really wanted, but um, <clears throat> what I did get was pretty cool. And the first one is another picture disc. And I'm going to preface by saying that I pretty much think Metallica, after the Black Album, it just went to shit. You know, I don't really enjoy anything they've put out after that. But when I saw this, I just, I had to have it. And it's, uh, Creeping Death. And on the back. Good. It's a band. So, yeah, add that to my collection of, uh, picture vinyl. <clears throat> and, uh, this next one I actually had to look up to make sure it was an official release. Because, I mean, just look at it. Yes, this is the vinyl version of the new Iced Earth album. Two LP set, limited to 500 hand number copies. I got number 405. And uh, it did come with a sticker, and I left that out in my vehicle like a dumbass. So I can't really show it, but it's just a cover, the cover art. But yeah, this is what the vinyl actually looked like. No labels, I have no idea which one's side A, which one's side B. I'm assuming the way they're shoved in here, the way they put them in there, that's the order they're supposed to go in. So, I don't know, we'll find out once I actually get around to listening to this. <clears throat> and then this next one was a total blind purchase, but for $10 I thought it was worth investigating. It's a Chilean black metal band called Kithrone, I think is how it is. It's called Colt Destores. Really awesome artwork on the front and the back. I thought it was pretty cool. And uh, this thing is released through Diabolical Services out of New Jersey. Limited to 666 copies. I got number 320. Like I said, for 10 bucks, it was worth investigating. And uh, yeah, I'm really happy about these last two here. Um, <clears throat> and that's. Vasilis, Cryptborn, and Tethered to Rune. And of course, you know, that nice Inquisition inspired artwork, which the guy that does the artwork for these guys does the same artwork for Inquisition, so go figure. And then also their latest EP, All Uproarious Darkness. Again, awesome, awesome artwork. And I absolutely love their logo. So, yeah, that is my short vinyl update. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing. And as always, stay brutal.